Hello everyone and welcome to Brick Bus. My name is MJ and today we have got a pack opening. We've got 12 packs of Lego minifigures series 16. Okay, this is the first time that I've had series 16, so uh, I need all of them currently. Um, once we've opened the first one, I will go through what my top wanted ones are, but I think the kind of weird blue haired bounty hunter thing is, is one of them. Um, right, okay, so this is cool. Okay, so this is the Mariachi guy, dude. Uh, he has got side printing on his legs, and the uh, thing that I really like about this guy is the acoustic guitar. That's a really great element, so that's, that's very cool. Uh, not one of the ones I wanted, but it's a cool figure to start off with. So having a look at the list, I do like all of them actually. Um, but my most wanted is definitely the Ice Queen, uh, the Bounty Hunter thing, the Penguin Arctic person, the Dog person, the Rogue, the Spy. I'd like a banana guy and a babysitter. Uh, the others are, you know, I want them, especially the devil guy, uh, but they're not my top priority. Next one. Okay, so we've got the boxing woman, female boxer. Cool to get that boxing glove mold again. Okay, so she's quite cool. She's got dual molded, uh, from what I can see, I think they're dual molded and printed legs, uh, which is which is really nice. Uh, I like that you get the, the hat as well as the actual hair, so that's cool, and yeah, just not a bad figure, pretty good. Next up, yeah, we have another Mariachi guy, so a duplicate straight away, which is disappointing, but at least we've got a couple of those guitars now, which is a nice element. Right, what we got in here, pack number, oh okay, we've got the devil, this is good, the red devil kid. Okay, so there is Devil Kid. He's actually really, really great. He's got some fantastic elements. Uh, I love this horned tail. That really is great, and the wings as well. Nice little confectionery basket as well. And I think he'll be extremely useful for some customs. Next one. Oh, this is the pirate. There we go, he's not too bad. Uh, he has got really nice side printing on his arm there for a tattoo which is really cool. Uh, one thing I don't like about him is the kind of bald cap thing. You know, no hair on a Lego minifigure is just a stud and that's really, that represents baldness. So I don't know why we need, I don't know why we need this weird uh, thing. It just looks a bit odd to me. Uh, but yeah, he's not too bad. His face printing is all right. And uh, yeah, as I say, decent side printing. Next up. Yay. So I don't know what she is, whether she's like a space bounty hunter or whatever, but I, I really like this one. She's awesome. The hair is fantastic. Nice bright blue with a silver stripe in it, which looks really cool. And there's some cool printing on the armor and on the legs as well. Um, and then on the arm as well, there's also some really nice printing. Uh, so yeah, very cool figure. Next one. Oh yay, we've got the dog guy. This guy's really great. The uh, dog is very cute with the little tongue poking out and the fluffy tail, uh, so that's very good. The uh, trophy's actually got a little bit of print in there. It's quite odd printing, because it's like silver printing on a pearl uh, silver uh, trophy, so it doesn't stand out very well, but it's, it's actually quite a good effect. I quite like it. The charming grin on him is very good, but of course the best thing about this set is that new hairpiece. Uh, that is an absolutely awesome hairpiece. That looks very, very cool indeed. Great figure. Okay, next up. Ooh. Hiker. Okay, the hiker. I actually wasn't particularly interested in this guy, but he's really great. The compass is fantastic. Uh, they, they could have done that on a circular stud, but it's uh, not, not too big, big of a deal at all, really. Uh, he's got nice legs and nice printing on the uh, torso as well. The map is very cool. His expression is brilliant, very like a lost expression. And then he's got that new backpack as well, which looks great. So yeah, he's actually a surprisingly good figure. Next up. Ah, oh, excellent, Spy Guy. We're doing uh, very well with figures here. Only one duplicate so far, which is great. Wow, I really like this figure. He's actually really cool. Uh, again, I love that new hairpiece. Uh, I will remove those goggles in a minute to show you what he looks like without it, but even without it, Although you can see the little dots for the uh, goggles, he actually doesn't look too bad. I love the accessories, the black rope looks very stealthy and cool, uh, and also his backpack. And uh, his head is great as well, looks uh, just out of Mission Impossible. And then as you can see, the hair actually doesn't look too bad, especially from the front. 
Um, it's only really when you catch uh, a look at those little dots that it's uh, a little bit annoying, but yeah, not bad at all. Cool figure. Okay, I think we'd be extremely lucky not to enter duplicate territory now. Oh wow, this is going very well. Yeah, really great figure actually. I love the penguin. The new penguin is fantastic and comes with a stud on the back and just looks very cute. She's got a dual printed head, so that's one side with like the camera taking pose. And that's the other with the goggles. And the figure itself is pretty good. It's got dual molded uh, legs and arms. Uh, shame they're not, the colours aren't reversed because that would be uh, quite useful for Spider-Man actually. Um, but yeah, really good looking figure actually, quite happy with that. Okay, penultimate bag now. Oh, uh, another pirate, so that is a duplicate. And then the last bag, is this going to be a duplicate? We will see. Oh no, it's not. Well, we did very well there then. Only two duplicates from 12 packs. So that's very, very impressive. Okay, so this is Goth Boy. You get this really cool Spooky Tales book, which is a nice touch. Uh, you get a very rare hair piece. I think, is that exclusive to this set? All in all, they've only done that piece in a few colours anyway. So it's great to get it in any case. And he's got some good uh, dual moulding and printing and yeah, just a pretty cool figure. So there we have it guys, there's the 12 packs of the minifigures uh, opened. I think the best ones are probably all my favourites are the Bounty Hunter, uh, the Red Devil guy and the uh, Spy. So those are all really cool. Thank you very much for watching, let me know what you thought of this in the comments below and subscribe for more videos.